Concerns over the coronavirus have closed some state parks, but our cameras caught multiple people bending the rules. CBS 17's Holden Krawicki spent the morning trying to catch up with the crowds, only to discover signs asking people to stay out. As temperatures across the triangle reach into the mid-80s, it seems everyone has the same idea. Yeah, we thought we'd go out and get the morning exercise in. As the crowds pile into Umstead State Park, they're being greeted with an unfortunate sign of the times. It seems to be they closed the park off today. While statewide stay-at-home orders don't take effect until Monday, many people are finding it difficult to get around social distancing. Yeah, trying to find different places to go every day. Uh, we're trying to explore different parks, but it seems like they're one, closing one by one because there's just so many people going to that spot. I was going to try Eno River, but apparently we're not supposed to do any state parks. So I'm sure that'll be close too. Wake County Sheriff Gerald Baker has authorized his deputies to cite anyone not staying home with failure to comply charges. But that didn't detour many hikers. But if there were fines, number one, that would be the number one deterrent for me. Penny pinching aside, there's only one way to prevent community spread of COVID-19. You gotta keep inside because it's for the benefit of everybody, you know? Like, it's not just for, for us. It's annoying, but it's for the good of society. That's why you're being asked to stick to city parks, greenway trails, and even golf courses throughout the coronavirus crisis. In Raleigh, holding Kerwicki, CBS 17 News.